Uh, ever since I got into motorsports, I'd wanted to try to develop a, a building that uh, represented the design and mechanical engineering and technology that, that we see in race cars. And it had to be evocative because obviously race cars are very uh, emotional uh, beings, if you will. When you see them, if, if it doesn't elicit some sort of response in you, it, uh, it's, it's not really an iconic car. And so when we designed this facility and, and started laying it out, we wanted to have a lot of the cues and styling symbols from the automotive world. And so if you look at the, the flow of the space and the design of the space, the, there's a lot of uh, symbolism from, from automotive design. If you look at the curvature of the showroom glass wall and, and the sloping hood of the, of the showroom, it, it looks like the hood of a car and the grill of a car from outside. Um, there's lots of uh, chrome and, and, uh, and shiny components that you would find in a car. The media room has a burl uh, uh, cabinets to look like a burl dash, you know, upholstered walls and, and whatnot. So it, it definitely has a lot of styling cues that carry over from the automotive world. It's also a pretty inspirational space. It's a, it's a space that uh, is full of natural light and uh, really allows people to, to know what's going on, typically in, in workshops you might not get a lot of natural light and you'd sort of be stuck in a cave and this is just the opposite it's, it's flooded with natural light and i think uh, the people who work here enjoy that the space was also designed in such a way that there was very easy communication and, and inner uh, flow of, of people back and forth between the shop space and the front office space the engineering department and and the support staff and whatnot so it's a it's a very easy building to, to work in no one is more than a few steps away and uh, as such, it's really helped facilitate the, the flow of work at Highcroft. Uh, there's, there's really no wasted effort having to run across to other buildings or anything like that. It's all located right here. The truck, uh, one of the two trucks is an integral part of the shop, so that a lot of the spares that we keep in the truck are right there, so you don't have to load and unload the truck each weekend. So it's been, it's been a really effective, uh, effective sales tool for us as well. Um, we've got a, a kitchen that can handle uh, quite large catering. Uh, capabilities so that if uh, OEMs want to do events here, um, we've done car launches here, several different car launches for various different manufacturers and it just lends itself very well to, to entertaining and, and, uh, and, and working in a really exciting environment. Well, clearly when I designed the building and, and worked on it and, and was initially envisioning what it could be, we didn't know yet that we were going to be running uh, manufacturer programs, but certainly it was an aspiration of ours to do so. So we designed the building with what an OEM would want to see. And uh, if you look at the way the uh, manufacturers are going with their, with their dealerships now, they're standalone, high design, very, uh, very modern looking, sort of Italian industrial look, if you will. And it, you know, it's evocative of, of the brands that we represent to have a, a facility of this caliber that um, really represents the excellence in manufacturing and, and design that the OEMs bring to the table on a day-to-day -day basis. It's, it sort of goes hand in hand with, with that type of thing. And it's a, it's a showcase for us, and it's been a wonderful showcase for the manufacturers that we've worked for in the past.